Today I am going to bring you my chewy coconut cookie. This cookie is full of coconut. It's full of brown sugar so it has that caramely flavor. These are absolutely a favorite of mine. I love chewy cookies. I love coconut. So let's get to the recipe. So in my bowl I have one cup of butter which I am going to cream. Okay, so I finished whipping my butter and I have added two cups of brown sugar and two eggs. And I'm going to beat this till it's light and fluffy. And then we'll add our coconut and our vanilla and then our, our dry ingredients, which is um, two and a half cups of flour. Okay, so in here, I have my main batter, the flour, the sugar, the butter, the eggs, the little bit of salt, the baking soda. Now I'm going to add my coconut flakes and I'm going to add my white chocolate chips. I forgot to say this is a white chocolate chip coconut cookie, chewy coconut cookie. And now I'm going to add my white chocolate chunks. It's about a cup and a half of white chocolate chunks and uh, two cups of uh, sweetened coconut. And for a twist, if you want these to look more festive, you can add green and red sprinkles. You can add, actually you can add uh, colored coconut. You can add some color to your coconut. And they can be green cookies. They can be red cookies. They can be whatever color you want your coconut to be. And they can be a little bit more festive. Um, you also can just sprinkle some colored sugar on top um, to make them more festive. But for me, um, if I when I put these in my cookie boxes this year, they will be plain because <laughs> that's the way I like them. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my cookie sheet and I'm gonna put my cookies on my cookie sheet. So I'll be right back. All right. So now I'm just going to drop spoonfuls of my batter on the cookie sheet and um, trying to be as close to, ex you want to try to make them as close to even as possible so that they will bake evenly. So I'm going to try to make them as close to even as I can without making any too, too big or too, too small. about the same to me. Yeah. So I'm going to do this whole cookie sheet and then see what we got. Alright. Okay. 
So I hope you are adventurous to try maybe something that you've never tried before. That's one thing I miss. I wish my mom had did is is tried to change up the cookies one year. But every year she did the exact same cookies. But people loved them, and I think that's why she never did. Is because people were expecting the same cookies, you know. But I wish she had changed it to kind of shake them up a little bit. <laughs> so they could stop expecting the same thing, you know. So I'm just trying to make sure they all look about even. These are going to bake 12 to 15 minutes probably closer to the 12 minute um, these cookies you don't want to over bake them you don't want them to be too brown because you want these to be as soft and chewy as possible so I'm gonna go put these in a 350 degree oven and I'm going to watch them um, and I'm probably gonna take them out about 12 minutes okay our first batch of our chewy white chocolate chip coconut cookies have come out of the oven and they are nice and golden brown just the way you want them and I hope you try this cookie this cookie is so delicious I like coconut just in general um, but I was fooling around making some uh, chocolate chip cookies one time and I didn't have any um, sweetened coconut flakes so I decided that I would sweeten the coconut flakes myself by adding some corn syrup to them and <laughs> the result was it made my chocolate chip cookies so much more chewy and they stay chewy longer because normally my cookies are a little bit chewy with a little bit of crispiness on the edges but when I added the corn syrup to my um, coconut it made my cookie la stay chewy for a much longer time so a week and a half later I still had a couple of cookies in the bag <laughs> which is rare <laughs> But a, uh, a week and a half later, I went to eat one of my cookies, and it was still chewy. I could tell it was a little older, you know. It wasn't as soft, but it was still chewy and still delicious. So, um, I suggest that when you bake cookies, that you buy the dry coconut and add enough corn syrup to moisten your coconut. You don't want it too much corn syrup but you want it to be just moistened so that it so that if you were to compare it to regular sweetened coconut it would be similar so this is what our cookie comes out like it's a chewy cookie it's so delicious so chewy you're gonna want to try this cookie so I'm sorry. <laughs> so delicious. But I do hope you tried this cookie. This cookie is um, a creation of mine, like I said. Um, it has my homemade um, sweetened coconut in it. And um, try this cookie for yourself, and you will know. You will see what I'm talking about. Um, get you some. Um, some vanilla or some white chocolate chunks chop them up add them in here this also will be good if you wanted to add some cranberries into it or some nuts explore try something different you know um just because i gave i'm giving you a recipe for a cookie that's good you might be able to make it better put some orange flavoring i'm sure that orange flavoring in there with that coconut i'm sure that will be delicious i'm gonna try it with some ginger and that's gonna be one of my cookies later down in the week i'm gonna try it with ginger and see how it turns out but i challenge you to to, to try something different let me know what you tried you know maybe you want to put some chocolate chips in this cookie i don't know but 
you try it out see how it comes out please remember if you like this video give me a thumbs up and remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video and please if you like the videos you want me to continue producing videos subscribe and share it with your friends let them see the good videos that I'm doing too and stay tuned coming up this week is going to be my first contest for this holiday season so that you who are here in the greater Los Angeles area can win uh, a dozen cookies fresh baked to your home from my home to yours thank you for watching have a blessed rest of your day bye for now <laughs>